good morning what is going on right here what is this this golf cart this golf cart is about to fall off of this I mean, I don't know. Does, does that not look like it's about to fall off of this flatbed? Let's get the focus on that for a second. Yup, it's about to fall off. Uh, it's been a little while since we've had the old video going, but we are here in Louisville, Louisville, Friday morning. Friday morning, we got our cup. We got our cups. How much water would you like in your tank? We got a cup of Joe. Ow. And uh, we're just arriving at the venue. It's gonna be a full day. We got course pre ride at 10:50. Uh, it's now 10:10. We've got 40 minutes before we get on track. We got uh, pizza with the kids. After that, we have a couple of good buddies of mine racing. After that, and then back with more course pre ride. After that, and we'll be done for the day. Be good. I think we're gonna try and spend as much time. Uh, on course today rather than tomorrow, but still focus a little bit. You know, let's just let's just go along for the sights. Uh, side note: Why do I have to pay to get into the venue when I've already paid to register and I've already paid to park this whole thing right here, in here? It's to pay the volunteers. It's to pay the volunteers. I got it. Got it. So thank you very much, Lucy Cycling. Now we're just out on the road. A little warm up action. Pre ride, as I said opens shortly. We're at a new venue, Joe Creason Park. And last year we raced here, it was sort of a mid-week or mid-season low point for me. So, didn't have a great race this year. I think that kind of left a bad taste in my mouth for my thoughts on this course. I'm coming in open mind, feeling fresh, hoping for a certain condition, but I think it's gonna be all for the good, good. We've been on fantastic streak the last little bit. It's gonna be good. Uh, conditions are gonna change tonight, tomorrow, and then Sunday. And But a lot of people are like, well, why so much preparation? Why all this? I like riding the course, right? I'm not gonna sit inside and ride the rollers. And I figure that if I can learn the course now, in good conditions, learn the turns, then when the conditions change, I won't have to worry about having to learn the course and adapt to the conditions. Now it'll just be like, okay, got this. We're riding the course. Got a little bit of mud here. We're gonna adjust our angle on the turn, so to say. So I like to spend as much time on the course as possible and just get a feel for things, get comfortable with it. And I like to have everything set out a ways away. We ride it Friday, we ride it Saturday, we ride it Sunday, and then we race on Sunday. So that's a lot of pre-ride time, but I really like it. The same thing, uh, occurs at like world champs when we do three days of pre-ride and then race. Uh, it's just time to learn. Just always be learning. Always be learning. Okay, well we're back in normal clothes. Now you're probably thinking, we went from normal clothes to bike clothes to normal clothes very quickly. Two things. I'm Clark Kent. Kish didn't know. It's my, my alter ego. USAC only gives us 20 minutes to pre-ride the course. So in the process of those 20 minutes, I wasn't even able to like spend enough time to get some B-roll for you guys, pre-ride the course, pretty much you know digest everything that we came across out there. We're back in normal clothes. We're heading over to SRAM for pizza with the kids for uh, a little bit of grub. I'm gonna say hi to some folks, sign some signatures, some John Hancocks. Pizza was great. That was probably some of the best cheese pizza I may have had in one while. Very good. I'll give it a solid 7.2. Track comes open in uh, about five minutes. So, we head out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, post it. Yes, yeah.
temperatures plummeted quickly out there. Today, it's almost like four o'clock hit and it just went whew, sink. Uh, rain's picked up so that our morning pre-ride ended up having some sticky mud. Um, kind of heavy conditions, not, you know, nothing too crazy. A little bit of grass sticking to the tires, but not enough to really warrant pitting. While the Masters like 45 to 49 race was going on, I should say it started to rain, went away quickly, quickly. And then uh, about, well, right after pizza, while we were at pizza, when we were walking back over to pre-ride, or to get warmed up and changed again to go for the second round, skies opened up, I mean like opened up, and it quickly became a grease fest. So it got cold, it got rainy, it got slick. Slick and slick. Uh, yeah, feeling good. Wanna know, I think we're going barbecue tonight. Doc Crows, we can actually see it from our hotel room. It's sick. Right, right. It's, it's, it's right there, it's, it's right there, barbecue. We'll just run wind it up here, wrap it up here. I'm not vlogging, I'm vlogging from Din Din. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. More course pre-ride action. Uh, Volvo day three. See you then. Day two. Well, I don't even know how long we've been here. We've been here. We got here Thursday. Today's Friday. Tomorrow's day three. Yeah. Okay. Adios. Over now. Peace.